Weighing in at 275 pounds, the Ultimate Warrior. The Ultimate Warrior would bring an energy and excitement to WWE that had never been seen before. All the little warriors can depend on one thing. The Ultimate Warrior will bring it to you. With the support of the WWE Universe, the Ultimate Warrior would make a splash with his unique style, strength, and speed. Just absolutely awesome. The Ultimate Warrior's momentum was reaching a fever pitch, and the time had come for the intense competitor from parts unknown to set his sights on the reigning Intercontinental Champion. Never been beaten, can't be beaten, won't be beaten by anybody. Line them up. <laughs> oh, and I'll knock them down. For 454 days, the Honky Tonk Man reigned as the Intercontinental Champion. And in his arrogance, he would make an ill-fated challenge going into 1988's SummerSlam. like he's got something to say. Give me somebody out here to wrestle. I don't care who it is. This you in a challenge says he doesn't care who comes out. New York City crowd. between Andre the Giant and the Ultimate Warrior traces all the way back to August when Bobby Heenan lured in an unsuspecting warrior only to be attacked from behind by Andre the Giant. Uh, it was a well-orchestrated plan on behalf of the brain and his end goal, bring the Intercontinental Championship back to the Heenan family. Of course, the Ultimate Warrior is vowed to never lose the Intercontinental Championship. Something has to give here tonight. There's that big Oklahoma slam. We have yet another title defense later tonight when Hulk Hogan defends the WWE Championship against the Genius. The Genius clearly using his superior intellect to be granted a WWE Championship opportunity. There's just no other way to explain it. For some reason, I doubt his one loss record had anything to do with it. Oh, ow! What a reversal!
Van Andre's size advantage over Warrior is obvious, but let's not forget about the decades of experience that... And Warrior's taking it to Andre here. Warrior! Whoa! Trying to knock the big man down! He He's showing no fear of the Giant! Andre knocked right outside of the ring, and now here comes the Warrior to continue this beatdown. I mean, King, how can you not be impressed with the Warrior? What do you mean? I am impressed. I think the world is impressed with the Ultimate Warrior right now. He's got the Giant, Andre the Giant, in big trouble right here. Bobby Heenan, he can't believe it. Well, Bobby Heenan better find a way to get that Giant back in the ring. Is the champion thinking about getting this match thrown out? That's smart. The title can't change hands on a disqualification, and the champ knows it. King, is there a more impactful gathering of superstars than the Heenan family? Well, if there is, I haven't seen it. Andre the Giant, Haku, Arn Anderson, Tully Blanchard, man, those names alone make up the best of the best in this industry. He was one step ahead on that one. Ultimate Warrior gets out of trouble, and quickly. Concern look on the face of Bobby Heenan as yeah. Warrior continues his assault on Andre the Giant. Yeah, man, you're right. The brain not only looking to bring the Intercontinental Championship back to the Heenan family, but he's also hoping for revenge after losing a series of loser wears a weasel suit matches to Warrior last year. Well, it certainly was embarrassing for the brain, but honestly, <laughs> did you? Oh, look at this. Andre missed the Warrior. Whoa, huge close up. Andre's in trouble. Andre's caught up in the ropes. You gotta know the Ultimate Warrior's gonna take advantage of this situation. And here comes Warrior. Oh, oh man, he uh -oh. runs right into a big boot from Andre. A giant boot from Andre. Warrior's hurt. And Bobby Heenan, he tried a cheap shot there, but the Warrior caught him. Oh! That's it. This is what everyone's been waiting for. Bobby Heenan finally getting his at the end of Ultimate, at the hands of the Ultimate Warrior. Now, Heenan and the Giant outside the ring. It almost looks like winning the title is a the secondary of plan here. As a result of a disqualification, and still. Intercontinental Champion, the Ultimate And it looks like Andre the Giant's attempt at winning the WWE goal again seems to come up short. No pun intended.